Hi folks, this is Vince with Dad's Gaming Addiction, and today we're going to try out Animals On Board, a game that we recently got. Haven't had a chance to play it yet, so this will be interesting. I did peruse the rule book, and it does remind me a little bit of Zularetto. Um, I'll explain why in a minute. But basically, you've got all of these animal tiles. They're numbered 1 through 5, different species. And on your turn, um, they start off in a huge clump. Okay? And you have the choice. On your turn, you can either separate those clumps into two separate groups, and then from there, one player can choose one of those two groups and split those off into two separate groups any way they want to. Every time they split into someone into a group, they get a food tile. Now, uh, the other option on their turn is to take a group. You have to pay the cost in food to do that, though, for each animal that you take. So, basically, you split animals to get food tiles, and when you're ready to take uh, animal tiles, that's when you spend these food tiles. And whenever you get 10 tiles into your arc, that'll sort of signal the end of the round, and you play the rest of that round out, then you score. The way you score is pretty easy. Um, if you only have one type of that animal, it scores its value. The animals are numbered 1 through 5. If you have two of them in your arc, you discard them from your arc altogether. So having two of an animal is bad. If you have three or more, they're each worth five points. So, you either want one of an animal, or you want three or more of an animal, not two. Okay? Now, this is the first player marker. I've given it to Vinny. Uh, as far as these trays go, real quick, I just want to note, pain in the butt to put together. Like, they, the pieces start off straight. You have to bend them, slide them into these holes here. I just, I, I hate doing this. Uh, you know, the steam part comes to mind. I, I broke... I don't know how many components trying to set that darn thing up. But anyway, I, I'm just I'm not very crafty. That's just a personal preference. But here's the box insert. Here's the animals that we're not using. In a two-player game, you're not using all the species. These markers indicate when you're done with the round. Whenever you take animals for that round, you're done. That's it. The other player has the other player has uh, one more turn to take animals or whatever the case may be. So let's go ahead and get the game started. It seems to be fairly straightforward, so why don't we go ahead and do this. Each player starts with a food marker, and I'll let Vinny go first. So what we do first is, in a four-player game, we use 12, um, or in a two-player game, we use eight species, 40 animals in total. So that's what we've done here. We've mixed them up. The rest are in the box. And then uh, once we do that, we're going to shuffle and draw stacks like we have here. Okay, And then we're going to draw uh, three each. One, two, three. You can draw three. We're going to keep one and put the rest face up into the table. So I'm going to go ahead and keep this one here and put the rest up and put the rest up into the table. And we'll do that at the same time. No, that's fine. So this is now one group, and now we have to draw from the deck up to a certain number, depending on how many people are playing the game. In a two-player game, eight are face up and one is face down. So um, how many did you just draw? Three. Two. All right, so let's let's do this. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna have this one face up. That. I'm gonna show them more. There. All right. So now we've got. Uh, this is one large group. And again, whenever we're ready. Okay. So I'll let you go first. Now you have the option. You can't take this because you need nine food crates in order to take this. There's nine tiles here. I don't here. think I would do that. Right. Can I split them? You can split them. That's that's what you do on your turn. So you can split them any way you want to. I'll do one and two. And then three, and one, two, and then three. No, no, no. And one into two groups. You can't split them like oh. one into three groups or anything like oh, that. Yeah, I'll do that. So it's one group into two groups. All right. Yeah. So you're gonna do that now, and you get a food crate. Yay! I get okay. A food. I'm just gonna do this. Now I'm going to. I'm using my trays on this side to put the food. I'm going to split. This is the strategy now. I'm trying to figure out how best to do this. Um, I'm going to split these three right, so that they're their own group now. So we've got three and three, and I get to take a food crate. Neither of us can take anything because we have two food crates. He's got three. What did you just do? Oh, you took a food. Yeah. You took a food crate? I'll split this guy. All right, so he's by himself. All right, now I'll, no, I'll do this. All right, so you're going to do that. You're going to yeah. do this. Okay. Can um, I buy something? No, not until after. You either do one or the other. You can't do both. 
Um, I, 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 uh, no, I could buy this if I want to, or I can continue splitting. Um, I'm going to go ahead and just... Hmm. I'll go ahead and use these two food crates to buy these two. Nice. And now you've got... I'll actually spend Now, one. once you do that, well, at first I get the first player marker because that was the end of the round. And then, um... I think I get one more. Hmm? I think I get, like, one more turn or something. At, after any player's turn, if there's only one player remaining in the round, this remaining player gets one final turn and perform either action A or B. Then the round ends. So you do not have to buy if you don't buy want one. to. So you're going to buy one. Okay, so you're going to take the one food tile. Yeah. Okay. And I take it. A elephant. All right, so now that's the end of the round. I get the first player marker. You're an elephant. I don't know. What uh, we're not even. I'm not even gonna bother using these. Normally they would go here no. to indicate that we're done for the round, but I I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna put them back in the box. I can keep track. So now again, can, we, now we draw player. tiles up to um, eight. Eight. Yeah, one. including the one that's face down, or not including. So. A lot of boxes here, so we've got one, two, three, four. There we go. So now, yeah. So there, that's the new round. Uh, I get to go first. I will separate these two foxes from the main group there. I'll separate these two. Okay. And I'll actually. No, no, no. You can't do. You, it's one group into two groups. That's it. No. Oh. You can't keep doing one over here, one over there, one over there. It's one to two. Yeah. Or one, one to I, one. I get one food. Oh, I get one food as well. I forgot about that. Um, okay. Just keep them on the table. You don't have to keep them in your tray. Well, okay. I'd rather have them on the tray. So oh, whatever. It's more neat. It's yeah, it's more neat, but it's also more of a pain in the butt. But whatever. There you go. It's your choice. Okay, so I'm okay. going to split... I mean, what are the side trays for? So I'm guessing that's where they'll hold the food. So we'll have it that way. Alright, so really what did the just... fox say? Hmm. He would take yeah, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> I'm gonna do these three and keep these two over here. They actually do that. I'm actually gonna spend two. Alright, so you're gonna spend two to buy those two over there. Okay. Does this bottom tray work? Yeah, each one holds five tiles. The top tray holds five and the bottom tray holds five. Oh, where did my other one go? Oh, I already have it. All right, now I've got a choice. Do I want to split and earn another food, or do, well, I can. I only have one food token, so I've got to just split. Fox. Yeah, and then um, yeah, and then I just take one food, and that's that's. So that. how many are there? One, two, three, four, five. We'll find six, out. Seven. There's seven. Five, six, seven. Do you need two more? Another fox and a zebra. Okay, so you were the first one to do that this round, so now you get to go first. I'll split these three. You're going to split those three, get a food token. Alright, I will split... these three, and get a food token. Actually, I'll split. I'll split these. Three. What? No, I actually just. I'll split this over there. No, no, you can't split. You okay. can't split one into another group. Like you can't move. I'll do this. You can't move from one to another group. They have to go into different groups. Okay. What are you gonna do? I will use three of these tiles to buy the foxes. That's what I was going to do. My turn. You get the token now. Mm -hmm. And now you have a choice. You can either buy or split again for more food. I'll buy. I'll spend two food. You're going to spend two food to buy the mystery tile. Ooh, it's a zebra. Well, you're not supposed to tell me what it is. Well, I don't care. <laughs> All right. It's, it's just a game. Like, so it's I, really know, bad. I know. I know. Ooh! Tigers and Tiger. one face down. Okay, new round. I've got six, you've got six, right? So the game's going to be over pretty soon. Um, so I get to go first. I will Oop. split... Uh, 
try to decide what I want and what I don't want at this point. Um, I'm going to split these guys over here. Can I split? Hold on. Let me take a food. I'll split these three off. What three? Okay. I get food. I will split... Uh, There's too much splitting. That's the problem here. I don't think that's an issue. Uh, I'm gonna. S s that's its own group. And I get a food token. I'll split this up. I'm sure I'll take. I'll split these two up. Let's split those two up. Move. Um. You could just split the one off to get three. And then you could buy the three there. It'll give you. I will. You've got two food, yes? Yes. Okay, I'm going to use two food tokens to buy these two here. Thank you. And that gives you... You're going to buy something? Those two. Yep. All right. I still have first player because I did that first. And we're getting close to our last round here. One, two... That's a fox, all right? We've got a... Fox, crocodile, zebra, three tortoise, and uh, the mystery. Okay. Okay. So uh, with me going first, I will oh, yeah, choose. You didn't. Oh yeah, you went off first. Didn't you? I will get. I'll split these two up. I will. I get a food crate. Split these two. If you get more than ten, by the way, yeah. you have to choose which ten you want to score. Just FYI. Okay. So you're gonna put these two by themselves. Yeah. What about this one? No. This one stays like that. Yeah. I uh, get food. Okay. Give me food. Give me food. I'm going to put the mystery towel by itself and take a food. We'll put a zebra by itself. The zebra by itself and take a food. Yeah. All right. Um, I will spend two food and take the two crocodiles. That makes me ten, so this is this is the last round. And it looks like you've collected some of your own. Okay. So let's go nice. ahead and Nice, I get full ten. Well, so I get to score all of them. Alright, well so do I. Alright, so let's go ahead and uh, let's see what we've got. Um so I just reveal them by itself. I got a crocodile. Well, I'm gonna and put my arc to the side so I can see what I'm doing. I got a super tiger. Look at that, look at that little baby. I got even a cuter. Five. And then two zebras. <laughs> I got five, three, one, and five, three, one. Right, so wait, you've got three zebras, three tigers. Let's organize and then two a of bit these here. guys. I got the two fives by themselves. Okay, well, that's pretty good. Okay, so you've got, uh, let's just, now these are by themselves. Yep. Okay. All right, so I've got a set of three, which, yeah. actually, let me move this up so the camera can see it. That's 15, I think. Alright, so this is, this is 20. They're, they're each worth 5. So this is 20. This is 15. So 20 plus 15 is 35. Then I've got 40, 44, 46. I'm not sure who's going to win this. Right, well, I got 6. Hold I on, hold on, hold on. 46. You've got 15, 30. Or 30. And then uh, 35, Four. Th 39. Oh, wait, wait. Let's do this. Uh, 40. Yeah. 47. 47, and how much did I have? I'm not sure. I think you have 42. Uh, 40. Wait, how much did you have? 49? or 40? 47. You had 47. I'm gonna, let me do mine. I have a terrible memory. All right, so that's just 20, it's 15, 49. it's 35, 40, 44, 46. 46, so 47. So you beat me by one? one. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> I mean, this is... Wow, okay, so again, this is 40, 40, yeah, this is 46, you got 47, good job, really? good game, okay. Good so, game. this was Animals on Board, did you like this one? Yep. Now, I'm a, I think this would play better with more than two players, but, I mean, as you can see, yeah. I mean, it, as a two-player game, it was pretty darn close, it came to, you know, if I, if I, had, maybe if I had chosen my panda one a little bit better, I might have actually won. Because, you know, I don't know, like, there were other tiles out there I could have taken. And again, it all base, it's based on how you split things yeah. and what you're going to take. And keeping track of what your opponent's taking, too. Because 
I had no, I wasn't keeping track of Vinny's takes I at all. I wasn't either with him. So I, I was like, okay, maybe I should be separating animals and like that he's taking. Like if he has, if I knew he has one of an animal, then I should be trying to separate that into one by itself so that if he takes it, he has to discard it at the end of the game. Something like that. I should have been maybe paying attention, playing more aggressively, offensively, but as it stands, we didn't, we didn't, I, neither of us did an offensive game. Yeah. And it was, it was very, very close. close. So good job. So that, again, that was animals on board. Do you guys want to see who draws the tie? Like, there's still. Yeah, there's still plenty more to go. <laughs> but anyway. You could go maybe over 10 or something. Nah, 10's good. If you guys want to see more gameplay, let us know. If you guys haven't already, subscribe to my channel. And check out my official website, www.dadsgamingaddiction.com. This is Vince and Vinny Jr. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you next time.